Jake, it's obviously not the result we wanted today as we exit the Senior Challenge Cup, but how would you assess tonight's performance? Um, obviously a tough one to take. No one wants to lose 4-0 really. Uh, frustrating, but I think we showed glimpses of the team that you know played some good football at times, did have a few chances, but um, I think it's probably a story of our season, if I'm honest, like with conceding and up putting in the, in the other end of the goal. Um, but like, there's a lot of pleasing points taken Saturday, um, so we'll, we'll focus on the positives and sort of try and try and rectify the mistakes we made tonight, and then obviously go into Saturday um, and try and get the win. And despite the score today, obviously we lost 4-0. We seem to take some control in parts of the games, and like you said, we definitely created chances, but unfortunately nothing's reaching the, reaching the back of the net. Yeah, yeah, it's just one of the, it's just one of the nights, you know. We've um, we have actually scored a lot of goals this season, like in the league and stuff like that. Um, so. It bound, is it bound to happen? Obviously, against a good young team, Bristol City. So um, they were pretty good at the back and stuff like that. But yeah, we've got to be a little bit more clinical, and hopefully, we uh, we can save them for Saturday. Of course, playing in the semi-final, these games are key key for the season. But obviously, with Saturday's playoff game coming soon, it must be a situation where you have to stop feeling sorry for yourselves and sort of keep them pushing to the final whistle of the season. Yeah, exactly. I think. Um, I'll have a think about tonight, we'll drive home tonight and sort of think about what we could do better and have a bit of a salt because it's never nice losing games, we've lost too many this season, that's, that's, the, that's the, the truth behind it. But as you said, we've got a cup final Saturday, uh, so we need to brush this one aside and then, um, and then get ourselves going for Saturday and you know, give everything on the pitch to try and keep, keep uh, Manor Farm in the division. And obviously Saturday is a massive game. What's the manager's message been to you and the players um, towards the final fixture? Obviously, um, as I said, it's a tough one to take tonight. So, one hand, he's obviously gutted about the result tonight. We didn't want to lose that. Wanted to get into a final and sort of give the fans a little something to uh, to get excited for. It wasn't our night tonight, but um, just said really we need to put this one to bed um, and just really focus on Saturday because that's that's basically our bread and butter as a league, and we're fighting we're fighting for our lives on Saturday. Yeah, and lastly, we've seen great support from the Farmy Army this season. They've been behind the players at the weekend. It must be good to sort of see some loyalty from the fans this year. Oh, the Manor Farm fans are, are really, like, honestly, top, uh, top notch. Like, supported us all season, and obviously things haven't gone away, but they've turned out their numbers pretty much, well, all season. So I can't thank them enough. They've been absolutely brilliant for me and the lads. So um, hopefully we can give them something to cheer for on Saturday. Excellent. Thank you, Jake. All right, thank you very much. Cheers. See you later. See you later.